The film kicks off with a lively scene, showcasing a crowd gathered around a circular arena, eagerly placing bets. Two individuals draw circles on opposite sides of the board within the tense competition. Positioned in the circle center, two men don bulletproof jackets. The objective is to force opponents out of the ring, creating palpable tension. Each match is a heart-pounding spectacle, with non-stop action. Our focus shifts to a standout participant named John in the midst of this gripping contest. Swiftly wielding his weapon, John lands a game-changing shot on his adversary's jacket, securing a decisive victory. The spotlight then turns to Colt, a formidable young woman engaged in a thrilling showdown with a stoic Balt competitor. Colt impressively fires off a rapid volley, securing a well-deserved win. Holding her prize, Colt approaches John, setting the stage for a fateful encounter. Undeterred by challenges, John seeks out the mysterious figure behind the event, duelist Serenger, through organizer Reggie. Despite his determination, patience is requested for the time being. Outside the arena, John crosses paths with Colt again, leading to a surprising revelation. Colt harbors a personal vendetta against Red, an acquaintance of John's. Colt enlists John's help to track down Red, revealing that their journey leads to the town where Red is located. Lacking transportation, Colt offers John a ride in exchange for assistance. As they travel, tension transforms into candid conversation, bringing them closer. Their journey leads to a desolate train station, where John prepares for a skillful showdown. Meanwhile, Colt engages in a cryptic dialogue with a mysterious figure named Huey. The truth about Colt's motives unfolds, and Huey reveals startling information about the person she's hunting. The duel begins with John collecting his thoughts and securing victory after a well-placed shot. The focus shifts to Colt, facing a high-stakes challenge against Huey. A daring bet is placed, and Colt's remarkable agility leads to an exhilarating outcome. The story unfolds in a dimly lit hotel room, where Colt delves into the heart of the matter, questioning John's initial hesitation. John, revealing vulnerability, confesses a desire to experience the impact of a bullet. An unspoken connection forms as they continue their journey in the morning light, pursued by a relentless police cruiser. In a gripping cat and mouse chase, Colt attempts to outmaneuver the law enforcement officers, but their pursuit proves unshakable. When their high-stakes escapade finally grinds to a halt, they're forcibly extracted from the car, and their concealed weapons are discovered. In the blink of an eye, Handcuffs bind them, and they are whisked away, alongside an enigmatic stranger. As Colt remains in the car, John and the third party are escorted outside, thrust onto opposite sides of a grand fountain, to engage in a life-or-death duel. Desperation mounts as the Mexican man, trembling and inexperienced with firearms, pleads to be spared from the impending showdown. However, as the countdown unfurls, John takes decisive action, swiftly disarming and incapacitating the officers and the terrified Mexican. Remarkably, he leaves one officer alive, his sense of justice undiminished. Reuniting with Colt, John liberates her from her restraints, and the pair flee the scene. John's wounds led him to seek medical attention, but he remains unwavering in his pursuit of challenge and competition. In the evening, he once again steps into the spotlight, this time at an event masterminded by Reggie. He emerges triumphant, solidifying his conviction to confront the legendary X-Ranger. Determined to amass the necessary funds for this ultimate duel, John seeks out his friends, who hold the key to his financial ambitions. But for Colt, her quest takes a heartbreaking turn as she learns the truth about Red's fate. Their paths converge once more, but the sands of time are slipping away. John is resolute in his pursuit of Zarier, while Colt acknowledges the need to continue her journey homeward. In appointment and profound farewell, they engage in one last duel, opting to forego traditional shots to the jacket, instead grazing each other's heads with bullets, a symbolic gesture of their shared experience. As Colt bids John farewell, their destinies diverge. John secures passage with a farming family, embarking on the next chapter of his journey. Along the way, he encounters a fellow traveler and route to an underground realm of illegal duels. With determination etched on his face, John joins the fray, ready to risk it all, for the chance to gain the necessary funds. In a showdown of epic proportions, 
John faces off against an imposing and feared adversary. He empties his chamber in a relentless onslaught, but the adversary remains unmoved. When the bullets find their mark, John falls, but his spirit remains unbroken. The stakes climb higher as the adversary retaliates, firing a barrage of shots. John takes a second fall, but refuses to yield. With unwavering resolve, he rises once more, and as the adversary prepares for another volley, John seizes the moment and prevails. In the end, the referee's count tells the tale of his triumph. John claims his prize, pockets the hard-earned cash, and continues on his journey. Yet, as his wounds weigh heavily on him, he is eventually overtaken by fatigue, surrendering to a restful slumber. In the hours that follow, John awakens to find Colt by his side. Her caring presence envelops him as she tends to his needs, and as the next morning dawns, he discovers himself within the comforting embrace of a quaint home. Colt, with her generous spirit, provides sustenance and refreshment, but John's curiosity bubbles to the surface, and he yearns to understand her motives for returning. Colt, however, remains reticent, focused on her task of nurturing John back to health. Together, they share an entire day, allowing their connection to deepen and evolve. As John embarks on a regimen of pull-ups to reclaim his lost strength, he continues to persevere, his determination unwavering. Over the next few days, his unwavering commitment yields results as he regains his vitality and vigor. It's during this time that he begins to share the intricacies of his life, the chapters that unfolded before his foray into the world of dueling. He paints a picture of a simpler existence, a life marked by relentless struggle and an unending quest for purpose amid a sea of odd jobs, yearning for his place in the world. He commits himself to rigorous training, honing his skills with the gun, until he's brimming with confidence. With newfound determination, they resume their journey, arriving at a modest motel, where they decide to spend the night. The next morning, as they share breakfast in a quaint bar, two local lads wander in, catching Colt's keen eye. An air of recognition hangs in the room, shrouding their encounter in mystery. Soon, she observes the enigmatic figure, Reggie, pulling up to the bar to pick up a young man with a car. She pretends not to notice, a silent spectator to a clandestine exchange. Later, she suggests a stroll, but John opts for a well-deserved rest back at the motel. As the day unfolds, she finds herself thrust into a whirlwind of events. She witnesses a frantic girl brandishing a knife and gives chase, only to stumble upon a lifeless man inside the bar. Two ominous locals loom on the horizon, triggering a harrowing shootout in which John also joins the fray, dispatching their assailants. Shaken by the ordeal, Colt insists they must make a hasty retreat. However, the motel's owner assures them that the deceased assailants were brazen thieves attempting to rob them. With a sigh of relief, they regroup, but her resolve begins to move. It becomes evident that she is harboring an inner turmoil. She has reservations about John facing off against the formidable ex-ranger, fearing the specter of death that looms over him. Even if he emerges victorious, she believes he'll be forever altered. As she departs, she crosses paths with Reggie, but offers no words, merely a fleeting gaze. For John, the road takes a different turn, as he embarks on a journey orchestrated by Reggie. She ferries him to the presence of Zeringer, a man who stands as the mastermind behind the duels and commands respect as the undisputed best. A picture of self-assuredness, he laments the degradation of duels from elegant contests of artistry to sordid spectacles of gambling. John shares his sentiments, inciting a smug look from Zeringer. The stage is set, and Zeringer informs John that the duel will commence on the morrow, before making his exit. Meanwhile, in the privacy of his room, John finds himself visited by a half-naked Reggie. Initially resistant, he finds himself drawn into a tempestuous liaison. As the sun rises on the Day of Reckoning, Reggie, who's revealed as Zeringer's paramour, readies John's weapon for the impending clash. John, in solemn contemplation, prepares himself both physically and mentally. The trio embarks on a solemn journey to a secluded hill, the chosen battleground for their contest. Reggie, the impartial arbiter, removes one bullet from each weapon, leaving only five for the duel. A defining moment approaches. John lays his bulletproof jacket aside. This duel will be a dance with death, devoid of protection. As he disrobes, Zeringer's disdain is palpable, spurred by the sight of John's battle-scarred body. 
the two adversaries lock eyes in unwavering concentration. With Reggie's signal, they unleash their shots, a synchronized symphony of fate. Yet in the final moments, we witness John's solitary walk away from Zarinder's domain, the outcome shrouded in tantalizing ambiguity. The tale concludes with a gripping, unresolved enigma, leaving us to ponder the fate of our enigmatic protagonist. The end. So, what do you think of this movie? Drop your thoughts in the comments section below. Any constructive feedback is highly appreciated. Also, did you enjoy the recap? Hit the like button if you liked it, subscribe if you loved it, and feel free to share this content with your friends and family as well. Please check out our channel to find even more movie recaps of your liking, and don't forget to ring the notification bell to stay updated with our future videos. And that's about it, thanks for watching, and see you in the next videos.